roll that beautiful film footage. All right, shit's crazy back here. If you want to do a 360 spin, you can see these guys warehouse are flipping everything around right now, getting everything situated. 360. Boxes are everywhere. Boxes are everywhere. Boxes, Boxes are, are everywhere. everywhere. So, with that being said though, we doing? if you see us back here, there's only a few things we could be doing right now. And one of those things has to deal with a bird. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, that was a good one. This is a new handshake. I was trying right? to, I didn't know. I was like, wait a second, I need to do this. Yeah. Hand. But then my back good. just turned towards you. Is there a better way to do it? Yeah, I'm down with that. Oh, but I'm flapping the wrong way. Bro, that is my handshake for pictures when I when I run into people from the YouTube channel moving forward. So moving, <laughs> moving forward, if you see me, we're going to take pictures like that. I think that's tight. That's the early bird handshake. You thought of that. All right, so women's release comes out. Next month, I believe it's like first week of October. Next month. To me, my name for these is the Poor Man's Trophy Room Fives. The nickname for the shoe is the Bluebird, but you, we gotta do what we always do. Let's go to the tag and read out the colorway. Ice blue graphite. That's probably the closest I've ever seen to get. It looks just like Nothing that. crazy. Okay, cool. Whip so, it. here you go, big dog. Thank you. These are a women's release that come out next month. They are called the Bluebird Jordan Bluebird. Five. And I personally, first thing that comes to mind is the poor man's trophy room five. Yep. It it's doesn't almost, get any closer. It's almost that. the exact same suede too. Yeah, I love, right? I love when they do that. Well, you know what's funny? Stuff. When we, Let's the talk suede. back about this shoe. You saw this on, I forget, some early website and you were like, Ian, this shoe's coming out, it's sick. I really like this colorway. It really is. And here it is. So here it is. And what's funny is I wasn't even thinking about the trophy room until you sent a picture in the group chat with when they landed yeah, and yeah, you yeah. showed us. I was like, damn, that's literally, now I see a real picture, not like yeah, on yeah. Kicks on Fire or Sneaky right. News or anything like that. So yeah, we can jump right into it. Long haired suede, super fucking dope. Really great quality, in my yeah. opinion. Yeah, they, they, no, they did it. They don't suede. typically do suede fives. It's not very common mm -hmm. and not a lot of, I mean, Raging, Raging Bulls, Bulls had this, this yeah, long Raging hair from Bulls. back, the, not the ones that just dropped. Yeah. The older OG ones were one. longer like this, yeah. which came in the pack. Right. Raging Bull pack, the metallic five and the Raging Bull came together. So the leather's real nice. You got the metallic tongue, which is very common in fives. A lot of these fives do metallic tongues. So I'm a fan of the metallic tongue. Then you have the satin inner lining which I'm also a fan of. You and like the satin? What you've also noticed is like, a lot of these women's releases, Alayla Mays, Black Satin Toe Snakeskin Jordan 1s, yep. these women's release shoes, yep. they, they like to go back and do this like satin. For sure, for sure. I get satin is like Very girly. lacy, women, lingerie, feminine. whatever, yep. feminine. So again, I'm a fan of it though. I even did it on the tongue as well. I like the shades of just different color blue. Can we talk about this? I like that they just kept the actual netting versus the Shattered Backboard. Drake, do you have the Shattered Backboard 5 out anywhere? When like, is that It's actually not out yet either, but. We should go over it, that. It, we can go over that too. And well, the, you're just about to pull it out. It's coming. Well, we'll go over it. In between? Merger. Sometimes we merge. merge. Sometimes we forget we have merge. early birds. Merge. This one's soon though. There's this a merge. Soon, though. This There's is a merge. Like, this is like this weekend, so it's very By the time soon. this releases, yeah, it'll, already, it'll be already be out. But so we can, we can talk it. about, I like that they kept the cage here. And Michael was talking to me about this. He, we were talking about, he's like, man, the other one looks cool. It looks like it has kind of like a cage material, but you can see oh, like, no. you That's see what they different. did? No. Like, yeah, like it's not the same. It's a different great looking yeah, material. Like, this is the OG yeah, great on sure. the five. Like not that. It's like all one solid piece. It almost looks like then that would be on an off-white. Right. In all reality. So it looks like an inside out piece of the shoe. I'm glad they just did this on the shattered backboard and they didn't keep it going. So that's I'm a fan say. of the color scheme. So I love yeah. the shades of blue. blue yeah. And then if you look inside here, they even did like the baby blue jump man, which differentiates from like that steel blue jump man on the front. Like these shades, I'm not a fan usually of solid color shoes. Yeah, yeah. But, but this, these this come out nice. No extra lace with these? Nah, big dog. All right, no extra Usually lace. it's on the right shoe, yeah, too, so it'd, yeah. be on, it'd be on my shoe. No extra lace, you just get baby blue. Silver's cool. I mean, overall, this it feels real grippy. Yeah. Feel the like difference of the sole. It's sticky. No, feel this one. Yeah, this is right Yeah, this rubber. is like real grippy. Yeah. Well, you know why, though? It's because they kept the they kept the translucent sole going to the front instead of switching to rubber. Mm. That's yeah, why, you're right. That's why it's like And then that. look, if you lift, lift this bottom one, you got this little hit of a baby blue satin. Oh, yeah. A little 
little baby blue satin hit, right which is isn't on the shoe anywhere else. This the pull tag? baby blue on the on the lace lock right oh, there. Yeah. yeah, that's cool. I have a feeling that these are gonna be harder to get than you think because it's a women's release. It's kind of like the Shimmer 4s. They dropped the Shimmer 4s. It was supposed to be a GR and then no foot lockers, no foot sight stores here got them at all. Mm -hmm. It only went to kind of like boutiques, sneakers app, etc. And I have a feeling this is gonna be so? hard to get. Well, yeah. I will tell you, we have six and a half women's all the way to 11 and a half. So at yep. least somebody up to a size 10 right now can right. get it. And I got another shirt coming too. Which is good. And we end up getting one, two, three, four, five, Ten pairs. Yep. Ten there's pairs. There's more on the way. More on more the way. way. Yep. How many more you got coming? Uh, I think there's another like 30 pairs coming. So it'll complete all the size run down even a little bit lower than six and a half. We merged. Yeah. So I'm gonna just pick right back up with this. By the time you guys see this episode, the shoe would have already came out. But I'm just gonna go ahead and give you my opinion on the shoe. Yep. So everyone's calling these shattered backboards. Right. They're quote every every shoe's got a nickname when it comes out with different color schemes. Right. These are actually called the orange blaze quotated shatter backboards because of the color block that they used. They used sail instead of white and then they gave you the orange. So. Exactly. My opinion on this shoe, which is what you guys were talking about. Yeah. It's almost like they just didn't finish the shoe. Yeah. It looks like, it looks like, you remember the flight shoes? The lower level? Yeah, the Air Jordan flights? Yeah, yeah like, of course. I mean, not only that, but it looks this like, is like a, a mid color, or like yeah, the way they're doing it. It looks, like, it looks like that, well, I forget the name of the shoe, the, is it Air, the Zero something where it's got like that, the, the little safety buckle that goes over the front. It's just a shoe you go to Foot Locker and they have on the wall all the time. You know what I mean? I'm not a fan of the material they use here. I'm not a fan of the material they use up here. They also left it exposed so you guys can actually see yeah. the cushions underneath. Technically, usually there's a leather panel that over. goes over this. I will say it's doing, it's doing well in the store though because people really like the colorway. I mean, more or less, if you're wearing pants, you cover all this part yeah, of your Yeah, so the only thing you're gonna see is just, just the, orange, the bottom yeah. of it. Color blocking colors that they chose, love. Right. I love the colors. Right, they color blocked nice. Yep, I like the speckle. They kept the speckle going, right. which they speckled no it? speckled on this one. Oh yeah, they no, no speckle. A lot of shoes, I mean, a lot of shoes, oh, Oreos, a lot of older shoes, yeah. they do the speckle on here. So I like how they brought the traditional speckle back. Right. Overall, would I purchase a shoe? No. Do I think it'll do well in the store? Yes. Like I said earlier, the 3M tongue, it's just a real popular thing that they do here with the fives. Mm -hmm. 3M tongue, orange sole, nothing too crazy. There's no real detail on here. Yeah. Peach bottom, almost looks like it's peach with the clear over yeah. it. Yeah, like vintage, like they try to make it vintage. Maybe that's why they went with the, the sail color, keep it vintage on the bottom. I get the Do vibe. you like the shoe? No. Are you a fan of it? I don't hate it. You think it'll but do I, well in the store? It'll do well in the store, but I would never buy it. I even don't like how they do use that same pattern. Yeah, they just the kept time. the whole thing. They didn't do, even on this, look. You can see, this is what a Jordan 5 supposed, netting is supposed to look like. Like actual netting. Mm -hmm. This, they just kept that little side thing. I don't even think it's, uh, it's like, see through, like yeah, it's solid. It's solid. Personally, I would have probably blacked out the top and blacked out this toe right here. And then I think, I think that would have been nice. We've shown you the two other colorways so Nicks far. Nick's in the Nets. Yep. And but now? now we have the Chicago Chili Red Dunk EMB yep. 75th Diamond Anniversary drop. And it's, it's, the, it's, best the, it's, it's the best color. It's the best one. It's the best one, yeah. By far. By far. Qualities A1, you have the little diamond right there. Tongue, you have the 75th anniversary hit. And no hit on the sides. The reason why I think they did the Brooklyn Nets logo on the side which I think I spoke in the other one, but I'm just gonna reiterate again, right. is it was the New Jersey colorway when they were the Nets, but now they are Brooklyn, Brooklyn so that they, they yeah. went ahead and put the logo on there so that you know like what team is silver and blue, you just look at the heel and be like, oh, yeah. it's the, whenever they were yeah. in New Jersey. Yep. I wish they would have done like the old school Bulls logo, oh, like of been, the actual bull nasty. on here, that would have been sick, but yeah. they didn't and you know, it's no big deal because I still think these will do really well. I'll say I probably won't buy this shoe because I have the Chicago SB. Yeah, it's the exact it's like thing. The same shoe. The, the JP? Yeah, the, the JP pack. pack. JP pack, yeah. yeah. I do like the off-white, if you can see the differentiations. You know, you have white yeah, and then the off-white. I was gonna say that, it's not just white. I'm a fan of the vintage white. And yeah, like you said, the leather's really nice. The shoe will do really well. Cool. And This is the EMB Chicago 75th anniversary. Dunk. And then this is, I believe, a December release. 21st. This is the? Handcraft. There it is. And if you look at it, it looks like somebody just handcrafted a bunch of different colors. Yeah. pieces. It was almost like uh, the shoe's there and they're like, all right. And they got like patterns laid out. Like, yeah. all right, put together your 
two colors. It just reminds me of like a, le a leather, a, a leather worker, a leatherman, just like in the back putting this together. It looks like somebody it. that would wear a Carhartt would wear these. Yeah, I don't want this one. <laughs> so. There's no special theme behind this. There's nothing, it's not collabed with anybody. Yep. It's called the Handcraft. There's not a lot of detail on it. We know that it's coming out during Christmas. It's gonna be a part of the rollout that they do with the Jordans holiday pack. for the holidays. Mm -hmm. And there's just a couple different things. You got the fall winter colorway, tonal colors, browns, burgundies, not olive, but more of like a forest green. Yep. Everything is suede. You still got the leather toe and midside and panel. All is gonna be leather. You're gonna have leather up at the top, but the cool part is the 3M yep. and the 3M trim around. And the hidden feature, quilted. Quilted, quilted insole. Right there. Quilted now, collar, quilted collar. If you want to interchange it. Yep. Oh, oh. Oh, what? Oh, it's the same lace. No, it's the same lace. Oh, it's like the unions. Yeah. It's like the unions. I don't know any other shoe that's ever done that. No, My unions no do one's that. ever done that besides union. Well, we just figured out a little hidden a little Easter egg. A little Easter egg. So you got the two-tone laces. That way, all the way up. That's kind of tight. Goes to I mess orange. With that. I mess with that. A little pop to it. Matches with the orange hit on top. It just reminds me of one of those weird colorways like the Rust Patinas. Yeah. It's like biohack. Like a biohack too. It's the other prototype. Even the um, neon yellow and yellow. Uh, vo the Volt? The Volt. The Volt, yeah. It's just one of those ones where... It's clashing. Everything's clashing. Everything's right? clashing. Yeah. But for some reason, they do well in the store. Yeah. Biohacks, when they came in, Went crazy. everybody was skeptical about it. I personally didn't like the sewing patch that they did. Right. And then... Which I'm glad they kept the regular here. Yeah, me too. Yeah. And they ended up going fucking crazy. Yeah. If you go back to all the sneaker shows, you're buying, buying bulk bio of biohacks yeah. all the time. Yeah. So I think it'll do great. I think people will try to do like a reverse mocha wearing these. They'll wear jeans and then just have like this poking out and it looks like instead of the black and that, you have the reverse mocha feel to I it. I mean, in all reality, you could customize and just paint this brown right. too. Right, and then it's really just like a reverse mocha. Yeah. So. Cool shoe. Cool shoe. It'll do dope. Not my preference. Yeah. Too much going on. But, but I like, nice, but nice. I like it. Definitely good and quality. And a little hidden uh, shoelace was cool too. Yeah, and it's a good quality. But now we're on to the main event. The holiday. We've been doing some holidays, period. This is the whole, well, we're getting close to the holiday and we're getting it early. So it's Christmas in September, I keep saying. It's Christmas in September. I guess from all this waiting, they probably already know what it is because there's literally a how many pairs? Well, I, well we've, we've already sold half of it. 28, 29. So we got about 30 pairs right here. Just A lot of them have sold. Out. A lot of them have sold already. Though. And we actually put some up yeah. on network we did. for lower than what they're going for on StockX and some of them sold too. Network loved the turnout and I've asked us to come back. So we're gonna be doing these bi-weekly events where we're gonna be selling stuff in the store right. for great deals. If you didn't catch the network, we sold like five or six shoes under retail, four or five shoes at retail, and then a lot of the higher end shoes we're selling for like $20, $30 under the StockX going rate. Yep. So there's definitely was some deals. Yep. v -Lone shirts were going for like 80 bucks when they were selling on StockX for like 121 30 Supreme, Supreme was hoodie. Cheap. The Supreme yeah. tees were $55. Most resale stores were selling for 100 and up. Yep. So definitely some good deals. More than likely every other Tuesday at one o'clock on the network app. So we'll keep you guys posted through our social medias when we really find out the exact times. But moving forward, we will be doing more stuff with them. Without further ado, the shoe of the year. The shoe of the year? Yeah. Mm. The sh holiday shoe the, of the year. The GR of the year. Okay, there you go. That's the GR weird. of That's the year. Way better. It is the GR. The, of the year. most anticipated. How many years are we waited? 10. 10 years it, to get the uh, shoe. Over 10. It dropped in 2010. So yeah, so we're 11. It's, years. 2000, it's about to be 2022. I'm just drops. saying, when this last time it came um. out, People were getting shot for this shoe. Yeah, uh, like for real. at my old store when we were selling, uh, we started doing reselling like 2011. Yeah. And so there's still a bunch, you know, still around. People right. were still bringing them in. It was one of those shoes where it was just like sold out instantly. Yeah, this is, you couldn't get your hands on it. And what we have today is the Jordan 11 Cool Gray. Now, what I will tell you is one, I'm excited about the shoe coming out. Sick shoe. I like how they waited a really long time. Usually it's like five years, five right? Years. Usually they say that retros re-retro every five to six years. So every five to six years, expect a new shoe. That's why I won't buy my Chicago Jordan 1. Cause you know it's coming. 2014. But we've been saying we're that. seven but years we've out. we've been saying it. 
We, Nike, give me my Chicago what Jordan if, one. What if we end up being 11 years? Oh. Maybe for the iconic ones, they start. Now, if we're traveling and I find one, like Larry, he passed. Yeah, I don't yeah. know why he passed on yeah, that. that was but a if steal. I find a good, not a beater, but a good used one, yeah. I'll cop it. Yeah. I'm not paying $2,000 for a brand new one right. knowing that it's right around the corner, so I'll buy it used. I feel that. There's nothing wrong with buying your shoes used. A lot of my shoes, a lot of my old shoes are used. You guys see, we shop for used yeah, stuff when yeah. we're traveling. 100%. Here's your shoe. First things first, suede is exactly like it was on the 2010 pair. I think it's really good suede, to be honest. It's really good. They yeah. did the color. Is the exact same color. Yep. The color on the old one was a little lighter. But we don't know if it's just But we it's don't old. know if it was because it was 11 old. 11 years old, it's gotta change Even colors. if I had a dead stock cool gray in my hand from 2010, it would still be a different color. For 100%. So, we so don't know. shade was a little bit different. Upper panel was the same color. Right. Laces were the same yep. color. Sole is still the same. The breads changed the carbon fiber from like off-white to white. Here, then nothing changed. It's still the black and gray. Now I got something to talk about. The sole on this is the icy blue, right? Okay. The last sole, 20, what was it, 2010, was icy blue. The one before that was actually clear. Okay. They changed it. What do you think? Clear or icy blue? Icy blue. Icy blue? Yeah. Because this blue. is just like what I remember. I don't know. I can't say that. I've never yeah. seen that. But this is what I remember. You know, this is what I remember. Clear I remember would be this. cool too, but I feel like clear would get dirtier faster. I think that's why they switched it up. Even when you're walking around, like yeah. this blue is going to help hide some of the dirt. And if you step in a puddle or rain yeah. or anything I think like that's that, why they did it's going to help hide some of that from looking like it's getting dirty faster. Right. So blue sole is still the same. Carbon still the same. The only thing we can really spot that's changed which is the same thing that's changed on the bread 11s is the patent leather the cut, paneling the cut. is thicker yeah. so it's actually concords too i think same thing yeah well of and course. i'm just, I'm just talking about breads because we spoke about breads yeah, yeah. in yeah. an episode it's weird to say that we've talked about holiday drops already on the vlog, on the vlog yeah and here we are again talking about holiday, holiday so that lets me just know the consistency and still being here yep, a year yep, later and yep. whatnot super cool so thicker all the way across the board everything is is rised up a little bit more another thing that we noticed which we don't know if it's certain is this is more of a silver like shiny stitching the last one looked white yeah i will say if it was white before, it's not like it goes from silver to white over age. You know what I'm saying? Like over age, a silver doesn't turn to white. It would be more white would turn to silver over age or not even it turn to yellow. Yeah. So I'm pretty sure that's a different change too then. Now that I think about it, when could I put be. that in perspective. It really could be, it really could be. No extra lace. Nope. And what's also weird is the plastic shoehorns. Yeah, yeah. It's, it, no it plastic went, shoehorn back. and no plastic insert on the box. Yeah. I wonder and if And no is, pull out, it's I a top. Cause I wonder if it's an OG box. What would you even call that kind of box? It's, it's like a drawer, it's right? Like a slide out. Yeah, slide, slide out. out. With like a, sh a plastic shield on the inside. I love this shoe. We're all getting a pair. Yeah. We have Plain to. Plain and simple. I have to. I didn't get the Concords. I didn't get the breads. The I, thing didn't is, want the, I, I didn't had want the Jubilee. I got Concords. I got Space Jam. I got bread. And I sold every single pair. And I feel like an idiot. How much is a, your size right now? I don't, I don't want to look it up, bro. Don't look it up. I do. On Jordan 11s, my size 13 is the money size. One of we'll the most expensive. We'll start with Concord. Last sale was only 500. Yeah. That's good. Still a lot. That's still good though. It is still good. Jordan 11 bread. You think the bread's worth more than the Concord? No. You don't think so? Mm -mm. It's cheaper. Yeah. 448. It's yeah. also newer. Yeah, it's newer. 2019, 2018. So. But I guess that uh, concludes. All right, that concludes everything. Super dope. Super excited about some of these releases. If I had to choose my order, I would go Cool Gray. Okay. Bluebird. Okay. No, nah, I'm gonna go ahead and do Chicago. Chicago. Okay. I had a last split decision. Is that what you're about to interrupt me for? <laughs> yes, I was gonna tell you. Uh, <laughs> then this then one. Then the bluebird. Then the bluebird. Then handcraft. Okay. And I wouldn't even get the orange blaze. Yeah. We're gonna orange blaze would just Sorry. be over there. Why you no love me? Now keep in mind when I give you my opinion, that's just my opinion. Yeah. It's still a dope shoe. I just wouldn't rock it. And I would potentially rock all these. It's hard when you got to. so much other stuff here. If I had to, like, I don't like the handcraft, but I feel like I could pull it off. 100%. So this is my order. What's your order? This right here too? Exactly the same. Cool. Now, the real question is, what's your favorite shoe? Or what order would you wear? Yep. Would Drop that in the comments. I feel like the Dunk is gonna get more love. Dunk cool and gray? Cool Gray are gonna be battling. For sure, 100%. I mean, you said when you posted the Cool Gray, it's like... Yeah, it wasn't, people weren't as crazy about it as now, I thought they would Now, be. keep in mind though, you wanna know why? Because they weren't alive when it was... 
because a lot of our audience, me personally, I don't know our exact targeted audience, but in 2010, a lot of them probably weren't really into sneakers. Right. Like we were in 2010. Right, right, right. I was reselling this shoe when it dropped last, like and like I'm reselling this shoe now. again. Yeah. That lets you know how long I've been reselling <laughs> yeah. these shoes. You know what I'm saying? I'm here again 10 years yep, later. Yep. So it's like, to me, people who have been around when that was going on, they're gonna love this shoe. Yeah. But don't get twisted, like there are people that are into the old stuff too. Right. But a lot of people are into the hype stuff and the new stuff. And right now dunks are hype. Yep. Right now this color scheme yeah. is Chicago it's color the scheme. One. And it's the Chicago dunk. Yes. And it's the 75th anniversary diamond. So this, these it. two are gonna be battling. I'm going cool gray. I'm going cool gray too. Yep. All right, well that concludes everything of our early bird special. Yep. And we're gonna close it out with our new handshake. Is that cool? Let's do it. All right, guys, we got a special birthday in the house. It's our boy, Frank. He's been with us for about a year and a half now, I feel yeah, like. Yeah, it's, it's over a year. Frank's very special to us. He was a friend before he became a, a, you know, an employee here. So it's time for him to pick out his birthday shoe. I feel like I already know what he's going to get, but we'll see. I think I got the perfect shoe for him, bro. I honestly feel like he's going to try to get oh, some listen, super listen, expensive listen. and see if I got the perfect shoe for him. White Air Force. <laughs> yeah, we have two. To, there's only a couple of them here. There's so only a couple of hundred here. Yeah, let's give him a White Air yeah. Force. He's laughing because we just got 200 pairs of White Air Forces in right now. So if you look back, you can see them here. And then if you scroll that way, you can see them all the way over there too. These 200 Air Forces will be gone in like 12 days. Yeah, I was going to say less than that. So let's go bless boy Frankie, AKA Spider-Man. All right, little Frankie, come here. Frankie Muniz. Frankie. It's your time. He knew we were gonna of do it. Of course he knew. <laughs> Look at him smiling. All right, man, you know the drill. It's your birthday. We bless everybody on their birthday. You know the price ranges. You know how it works. Take a look around. Find you something you like on the house for your birthday. Thanks, guys. Yeah. Always what turkey. You gonna get? You what are you gonna get? Do you have an idea bro. what you're gonna get or no? I kind of had like two I, or three sure shoes has in my head. Yeah. Hold on, show me your haircut real quick. He switched it up, look at him. I told him he looked like a scene kid this morning. I mean, this was the high school haircut for me. I was like one of the first black kids to wear skinny jeans in high school. A couple more months, it'll look like the weekday. <laughs> 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 All right, what you got? Come on, where All are we right. going? Which direction are we going? I know where shoes are here that are my size. Uh, Ooh, drop, foul. Is that the move? I'm thinking. I like that shoe. I have that shoe. Yeah. I, I like, like the Velcros. Logo. I like the interchangeables. I like the color. I think that's going out of your color scheme. So I like that you are thinking that direction. Yeah. And this is the the first Weatherspoon that I've had. Yeah. You have one, right? Air Max one. I don't have any of his. No, he doesn't. But I like I, this. I, I did not. No, he literally made us hold on to the one we had forever. And before he worked here, he kept coming. He's like, I'm going to buy it. I'm going to buy it. I'm gonna yeah, buy they it. dropped it like six. Never and bought then it. COVID hit. Never I was like, bought I it. And then, we, my money. and then we got rid of it. I like yeah. That one for you, bro. Yeah, I didn't think this This is not what I thought. I thought you were going to get it No, not at all. I thought he was going to get off white, though. Yeah. I was thinking about it, too. But you already have so much off white. But everyone's been picking them. And like now the off white dunk is for me. Really? I'm gonna see more yeah. people with an off-white dunk than I will see with that shit. Right. Comfortable. It was my first split tongue. Yeah. Not gonna lie. I always wear my Nike short socks with this, so after I put them on, I gotta pull it real tight so that the split doesn't show the check. And let you set tripping? Bro. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I can't. You've been set tripping this whole time. Do you time? own Asics socks? Oh, I don't. I don't own Asics. Does but... anyone own a pair of Asics socks? No, Low no. socks. No. Okay. Does that? Do you want us to look around? Or is... Yes, I still want. Okay. So we'll hold on to this one. Okay. That's a contender. All right, what, where are you going next? You know, you I'm being taken. I need a key. I'm be oh, he needs <laughs> a key. I got the key. Scott got the key. You just go look. And the other one was one of these, this purple one. Which purple one? After you just talked shit about the off-white dunks? Yes, but I want to see them next to each other. I just feel like you have 72 off-white dunks. They're all whites. <laughs> yes. First off, yeah. You already have them. And now I, I really, I really what want to. What size are you again? Eight, eight and a half? Eight, eight or eight, eight and a half. Eight or eight and a half. This is a nine and a half. There's one over there. No, we. we I know that. Like, I, I know. know I know there's one. Nah, that's you. That's you. Almost that's positive. I have eight or ten and a half. This is a five. There is an, uh, an eight and a half. Well, then stock room isn't taking care of uh, restocking it. And this is just out. so many. Well, shoes. No, no. There's not enough space in here to have every size. It's all marked. I know up. I got space for one. <laughs> I know I got space for one of them. Okay, what else? If that's not it. Blake shopping for himself right now? Look at this. I have those, I don't ever wear them. I need a size 10 for a customer. I actually ordered it on StockX. Speaking of sneakers right now, 
Hayden's challenged me. He says I have a lot of shoes that I don't wear. So for the last nine days, I've worn a new shoe every day. And so I started off with the unions. Then I wore all three of the four of the greatest moments where he did like the Asia. Oh, the, uh, what was that it's, like a, it's like an accomplishment pack or whatever. So it's like for his MVPs, uh, all-star games. The clay whatever. green, moon, blue Anyways, moon. Anyways, today I'm on core purples. I'm really trying to go through a lot of Jordan ones right now. I'm gonna see if I can make it 30 days. So 30 days wearing 30 different shoes. Okay. So we're on day like nine right now. And you're up next. I'm not gonna do it. You're up next, big dog. And what's also that's doing is it's challenging me to wear different things. Like I wouldn't have worn these shorts, period, with this fit, but I noticed the purple yellow and I was wearing that. I decided with this. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna mm, throw a different color out that. there and make it, make it work. Right so too. thank you, David, for pushing me. Frank, what are you looking at? That's, that's it? it? Yep. Just those two. Yep. How hard did you think on this? I checked Bro, all the shoes I like in my size. What size is the gun? Alright, let's find the see if we have a size though. Oh, okay. It has to be that color. What lot yes. number is that? Well, I'll you. tell you right now. Uh, 21. 21. 21, 21, 21. 21. What size do you need? Eight and a half. What's not this team? All right, lots. 21. 21. 21. This, this was also oh, one, but my oh, heel no, slips he in this. He went, he's it's a little between. bit too big. It's an eight and a half, but it's a little bit too big. This was an eight and a half, but my heel slips in that. Yeah. yeah. If it's more like a nine. All right, so which way are you leaving? I'm gonna let everyone else pick. It's dangerous. I like them both equally. Nah, they're both dope. Yeah. The mm -hmm. only thing that's cool that I think this is it's cool about this is changing the colors. Yeah. You I don't have anything that's that colorful. Yeah. Shoe wise. I had but you the wear all black. black. And it looks good with all black. For those of you who don't know, it's here. two alternate shoes. It also comes with the alternate Velcro swapping for the logo. And it's got like these like weird like pinkish gray laces with the metal tips. And I'm a fan of these. So you also have his piece so patch. The world. Oh, I thought one was a And then one. more alternate colors to, to swap through. Okay, so now we try them on or what? I want to let everyone else pick for me. Each hand. So lot left, left lot, right, Sean. What do you think? Cameraman Mike. Okay, off white. What do you what do you think? Sean. Sean, what do you think? Sean. Sean, what do you think? Sean, what do you think? Young Sean. Sean. Wow, I was not expecting that. Steve-O, Steve-O, Steve what are you? He's your lot? lot? Yeah, yeah. Jordan, lot or Sean Wallerspoon A6? Lot. Okay, who am I missing? Chino, lot or A6? He said A6. A6. Lot or A6? He said it, so you caught him. Oh, out. it's over. It's over. It's over. Six. It's over. No way, there's no way to frame him. Even if me or Drake yeah, did it, we'd just not be enough. behind. Yeah, he's A6. So, do you want to hear my vote or Drake's vote? Or? Yes, I want to hear it. Well, that's how you're mm -hmm. deciding. You're going to let the people choose mm -hmm. for you? Mine, mm -hmm. Mine's lot. Wow. <laughs> mine's lot. So, right now it's six to four. I can bring Drake out if you want. Frank. Drake! 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 Drizzy! Drake out to make his first Drake. intro. Oh, Drake yeah. Drake go! And he's, and he's fly today. Our new warehouse guy is fly today. Yeah, Drake out. Hey. Young Nigo. This is our boy Drizzy. He's now working in the back with Chino and Jacob. Yes, so, here, Frank's picking between the two shoes. You're not the deal breaker, but we want to know which one would you go with if it was your free birthday shoe? I would go Sean Wood's Oh, oh that's seven and four. Oh, White Sean, five victory. Sean, Sean won. All right, so what's the deal going to be? You got seven and four. Let me get it. That's the deal. There it is. Straight to feet. There it is. There it is. All right. Happy birthday, Frankie. Yeah, straight, uh, straight, straight to toe. It's honestly like a, a, a fall and spring kind of thing. Like in certain days, I would take this colorway, but for fall, you know what I mean? Like I feel like a darker color. What about you? Well, which shoe would you take? Left if I had to pick like just yeah. as the only yeah. pair, yeah. Yeah. that one. Yeah, uh, that, that's me personally. Yeah. I like the, this the little, light colors. This little like, combo is just nice right here. Yeah. This, this is, is nice. This too, is it, it's nice, but it's very it dark. Pops it's the right it, way. Yes. that's my soul. Dark. <laughs> that's what you went with, Frank. Yes, it's definitely a Frank shoe. That's what I said. That's it is, but it's one. not. But it is. Put them on. Those see. are my beaters. I wore beaters to the store today. Let's see, Frank. What's the outfit gonna be that you're gonna bust with these? Who knows? And I feel taller in this shoe too. Appreciate the new dress. Of course not, I got you. I'm excited to see how you put it together because this guy always wears nothing but 
black. Mostly. So now we have literally every color <laughs> but black on this shoe. So I'm curious to see how it's gonna work. I really feel like he's just gonna wear all black and then just have like the shoes stand out. I so mean, I'm doing that right now. Yeah, exactly. oh, okay, yeah, <laughs> put them on, so exactly like that.